Hello, it's Paul from Fandroid.com and I'm here to give you a walkthrough of this really cool app. It's called Apps Organizer and we're just going to click up here and go to Apps Organizer and right away it starts preparing our list of apps. These are all of the apps currently on the phone and we're just going to click on one of these like messaging and as you can see it's selected for Android which means it's going to be under the Android category. We can select multiple categories for it to be under. Right now we're just going to leave it at Android and if you go to the labels tab at the top here you'll see all the categories and all the apps within each category. If you look at the gray subtext here it tells you all the categories it's in. So let's go back to messaging and I'm going to show you something cool. You can create new labels, new categories. So we're going to name this one social. Hit OK. And it's already selected for social so we'll just hit OK. Go to the labels tab at the top and there's your new category. Just select that and there you go, there's messaging. If you go back home, press on hold on the home screen, go to widgets, go to apps organizer, let's click on social here, and there it is, your social. You click on that and there's your app, messaging. Now let's go back to the app. I'm going to show you something else that's really cool. Let's take this out and put it in social. Let's take email and put it in social as well. Go back to the labels tab. Go to social and there you go, there's your three apps. Now I'm going to show you what those three stars on the right do. So I'm just going to tap one of those. Now let's go back home. Let's go click on the social icon. And if you click the star here, it singles out all the apps I have selected, which is the messaging app. Click it again and all the apps will be displayed. Now I'm going to show you another feature. Let's go back. If you click and hold on one of the categories, you can rename them, you can delete them, but you can also change it to icon. You can change the icon to anything you want pretty much, because you can change it to anything in your image gallery and there's icon packs to choose from if you have those. So we're just going to pick an icon here. Let's choose this one. And as you can see there is the icon. Go back home and it's there. Click on it. There's your apps. It's that simple. Overall this is a great app. Um, it's, it's essential to anyone who really wants to organize their apps. And if you want to read the full written review head over to androidapplications.com. Thanks for watching.